From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Monday, October 7th, 2013, the first full week of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. In our news, the UAF police are alerting residents to a dangerous situation. They report a possible sexual assault that occurred in the area of Haida Lot Trail towards the lower dorms at approximately 1210 Saturday morning. The suspect was described as a white male with light colored eyes, 5 feet 10 inches tall, muscular build, wearing dark pants and a sweater with fur lining inside it. People in the area are advised to use caution and to call University Police at 474-7721 to report any suspicious activity. Activity. An early evening vehicle chase involving Alaska State Troopers led to a vehicle accident Saturday that sent three to Fairbanks Memorial Hospital. Alaska State Troopers gave chase to a vehicle traveling at a high rate of speed on the Mitchell Expressway. The driver lost control on the exit ramp off Airport Way, launched off the side of the roadway, and careened into a college utility shed at the 10-foot level. Driver Christopher Turco then fled the scene, leading to a lockdown of the area. And the federal government is suing to permanently confiscate cash, guns, and synthetic marijuana that were seized during a May raid on four head shops in Fairbanks. The raid targeted synthetic marijuana, a drug known as potpourri or spice that state and federal lawmakers have tried to criminalize. Retailers continue to sell the product by marking it as not for human consumption and selling chemical variations that haven't been made illegal yet. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today, mostly cloudy, scattered flurries or sprinkles in the morning with highs in the lower 40s. Tonight, partly cloudy, lows in the mid-20s to lower 30s. Then tomorrow, mostly cloudy, scattered rain showers afternoon, highs in the lower 40s to lower 50s, and winds maybe to 20 miles an hour. Extended outlook, rain and snow through the week, highs in the 40s, lows mid to upper 20s, and the aurora forecast is low. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.